I'm Mike Ozog, Flexi Force Sales Engineer at TechScan. Here to talk to you a little bit about our Flexi Force sensors. The Flexi Force sensor is a force sensing resistor. It decreases in resistance with increasing force. It's constructed on three thousandths of an inch thick polyester film substrate. We then print our silver electrode on the top and then on the bottom, and then our proprietary pressure sensitive material in between, which decreases in resistance with increasing force. The relationship is linear in terms of conductance versus force. Conductance is one over resistance. The accuracy is approximately plus or minus five percent, uh, depending on application, and um, comes in three different force ranges, at least for our standard A201 Flexi Force sensor, zero to one pound, zero to 25, and zero to 100. We also have a high temperature model available. It goes up to 200 degrees Celsius and 400 Fahrenheit, which is printed on polyimide film. As, as you can tell, it's a little bit different, allowing it to go uh, to a higher temperature. Flexi-Force sensors are used in a lot of common applications, such as grip for humans or robots, medical devices, such as infusion pumps, monitoring occlusion, heel and foot switches, since they fit very unobtrusively in the foot, and force sensitive controls, whether it be gaming devices, braking, or even motor, force sensitive control of motors. Flexi Force sensors are also used in a lot of custom applications. Some examples are the DXF glove by Applied Fitness. Sensors used in the, in the palm of the hand to monitor, uh, basically push up forces and give the user some quantifiable information based on their exercises. There's a little display on the back that helps them keep track. The shot watch, which is a golf product, the user uses, puts it on their wrist and it monitors their grip force based on the increasing diameter of their wrist as their grip tightens. So they take a swing and along with a few other parameters, it, the Flexi Force sensor it monitors the grip force right here. X-Rite is another example. They produce a color and gloss measurement device and the sensors are actually a tripod and the basically measures balance, makes sure the device is parallel to the surface being measured so that the laser can go down and shoot back up in an appropriate uh, angle. Mamacare is a company that uses the sensors in a, for medical professionals to monitor for tumors and breast tissue. Inventory management is a good application for the sensors, parts in a bin. If a company needs to monitor a certain number of parts in a bin, they simply put the device under the bin and it monitors the amount of parts, whether it's full, half, or empty, and can even automatically send requests for reordering of these parts. Designers love our Flexi4 sensors because of their low power requirements. The sensor is essentially an open circuit when unloaded, and also the flexibility, design flexibility since they're so thin. They're only 8 thousandths of an inch thick, so they're very non-obtrusive. They're also, we also have a very quick turnaround time on our prototypes, eight weeks. Thomas Eisner from Servitrol actually noted that he got his prototypes in eight weeks and he was very happy and that's actually our goal here at TechScan. We also offer a lot of prototyping options, whether it be our standard sensor with pins or our complete system, which is software, electronics, and as you can see, you see a force versus time graph. This is the ELF system, simple calibration, and you're good to go.